Making a booking in Smartway 2 is very simple from the web console. We have a quick link to make a room booking, but we may wish to make a different type of resource booking. And these can be anything from rooms to desks, to parking spaces, to other types of resources. We can select the location in which we require our booking to be made from the left hand panel. And we also have a series of categories that we can fully customize to meet requirements. As well as a standard day, week and month view, we also have the ability to have interactive maps with multiple floors showing the availability in red and green for each of the rooms and the ability to switch easily between locations if we wish to book somewhere else. Once we've decided on the room we wish to book, we can select it from the map and enter any relevant details into the fully customizable form. This could include categories, a subject line, the date and time, we wish to host the meeting. And this can be selected from either the date and time picker in the right-hand panel, or if you prefer from the sliders at the top. As I select a date and time, the availability of the rooms updates dynamically. If I wish to have some prep or clean up time, I can add this to the booking. And of course, recurring features are available. We can add imagery to assist with finding a suitable resource. And if I have the rights to do so, I can change the host of the meeting and of course, add any attendees that I wish to receive an invitation. Catering options can be added and these can be very simple from a, a single select tea and coffee tray in this example to a more complex menu system with limitations on amounts, full pricing, and the ability to change when you wish the delivery to arrive. We can add Microsoft Teams credentials to our meeting and some notes. And when we're done, we hit the save button to make the booking. We can see the details in the right hand panel of what we've just booked. And we can see that this is going to require check in at the date and time of the booking. I can easily see my booking within the other views in the web console. As we can see, a little gray area has been added for the preparation time. It is possible to select the time you wish to have your booking within this day view with all the same options available which pertain to that particular room. If we move over to Outlook, we can see that our booking has been fully synchronized with our Outlook calendar. If we double click on it, we can see some information about the booking and that John has been invited. I've also received an email with full confirmation of the booking and information that I will need to check in when I arrive.